students in last class we have learned about types of fiber and their sources now i just recall the previous topic what is fiber fiber is a single hair like strand what is fiber a fiber is a single hair like strand all fabrics are made from fiber what is fabric fabric means cloth fabric means cloth next uh, fiber uh, fi next we see about fiber fibers are classified into two types one is natural fiber and another one is synthetic fibers natural fibers are obtained from plants and animals the uh, nat natural fi fibers are obtained from plants and animals the example of the natural fiber is cotton jute and core these are the example of the cotton natural fibers the example of the animal fiber is wool and silk this is the example of the animal fiber okay cotton is the sources of cotton plant edil irund cotton varudhu cotton plants la irund cottons varudhu okay uh, jute uh, the stem of the jute plant is the sources of jute first we see about cotton cotton is the sources of cotton plant cotton edil irund varudhu cotton plants la irund varudhu jute na enadhu sanal sanal vande edil irund jute uh, jute fiber edil irund varudhu stem of the jute plants uh, jute plant oda tandil irund jute fibers kedaikku adukapra core core means the outer covering of the coconut fruit core fiber is obtained from the outer covering of the coconut fruit next we see about animal fiber animal fiber is obtained from wool uh, wool is obtained from fleece of the animals wool is obtained from fleece of the animals this is the picture of sheep wool is obtained from the coat of the cat is called fleece adavadhu the sheep oda mudiya da enna solrom nama fleece nu solrom okay and beside the sheep some other animals also examples for the animal fiber beside the sheep some other animals are example for the animal fiber animal fiber first is angora coat angora coat angora rabbit first we see about angora rabbit angora rabbit it produce less wool angora this is the picture of angora rabbit it produce less wool but it is very expensive next we see about angora coat this is the picture of angora coat angora coat it yields beautiful white wool angora coat yields beautiful white wool next the next animal is llama llama it yields softest wool in the world this is the picture of llama animal it yields softest wool in the world next we see vikuna vikuna is also the llama family vigna is also the llama family this is the picture of vigna vigna is also the llama family next we see about kashmiri coat this is the picture of kashmiri coat kashmiri coat is the famous uh, kashmiri coat is famous for pasinama salts okay kashmiri coat is famous for pasinama salts next yak yak is this is the picture of yak yak is also produce wool beside the sheep sheep these are the animals that also produce wool next we move to the synthetic fiber synthetic fiber is obtained from chemical substance uh, the example of the synthetic synthetic fiber is rayon polyester and acrylic these are the example of the synthetic fiber it is also a human made fiber synthetic fiber is also a human made fiber we move to the today's topic this today's topic is production in plant fibers we already know the plant fibers are obtained from uh, jute plant cotton plant and core as yes. going to see about jute fiber jo in india jutes are majorly producing in west bengal west bengal bigar and assam jute is obtained from the stem of the jute plant jute is obtained from the stem of the jute plant and jute plants grows sandy and clay soil jute plant grow grows sandy and clay soil it is grown in rainy season it is also grown in rainy season after 6 month it starts to flower next after the harvesting stems are flower anadukapra enna pandrom harvest pandrom harvest na enadhu aruvada pandrom அடவட பண்ணிட்டு ஸ்டெம்ஸ் ஆர் சோக்ட் இன் டு வாட்டர் அந்த ஜூட் பிளானோட ஸ்டெம்ஸ் எல்லாம் நம்ம என்ன பண்றோம் வாட்டர்ல போட்டு சோக் பண்றோம்
this process this process is also called retting retting of jute plants enna pandrom jute plant oda thanda mattum thannila potu soak pandrom evlo naalna 2 to 3 weeks okay this process is called retting next retting is complete completed certain fibers are removed by hand after retting retting complete aanakapra enna pandrom நம்ம வந்து சாஃப்ட் அண்ட் ஃபைபர்ஸை கையை வச்சு ரிமூவ் பண்ணுறோம் தி ஜூட் ஃபைபர்ஸ் ஆர் தென் கிளீட் அண்ட் ஸ்ப்ரெட் அவுட் ஃபார் ட்ரையிங் தென் அந்த தண்ணியில் போட்டு இது பண்ண ஃபைபர்ஸை வந்து வெயிலில் காய வைக்கிறோம் தி ஜூட் ஃபைபர்ஸ் ஆர் தென் கிளீன் அண்ட் ஸ்ப்ரெட் அவுட் ஃபார் ட்ரையிங் ட்ரையிங் காண்டி அதை காய வைக்கிறோம் நெக்ஸ்ட் வி சி அபவுட் யூசஸ் ஆஃப் தி ஜூட் ஃபைபர் ஜே ஜூட் ஃபைபர்ஸ் ஆல் யூஸ் டு மேக் ரோப்ஸ் பேக்ஸ் கார்பர்ஸ் door mats and wall hanging and food fur these are the uses of jute fibers next we see about production of cotton fiber the cotton uh, it is a soft fiber it is obtained from the seed part of the cotton plant cotton fiber is a soft fiber it is uh, this is a cotton plant cotton plant uh, cotton fibers are very soft it grows in the black soil and warm climate and also a yeah, warm climate it grows in black soil and warm climate when the plants mature it start flowering plants konja valandakapra enna agu flowering idha poo mari pooko flowers develop into seed pods called bud these flowers are developed into seed pod this is a seed pods separate the cotton fibers from seeds uh, then we separate the cotton fibers from the seeds this process is called ginning uh, what is ginning ginning is a process it separate the cotton fiber from seeds cotton seeds la nde cotton fiber cotton fibers la nde cotton seeds a separate pandra da enadhu ginning what is a ginning ginning is a process um, that separate seeds from the cotton fiber cotton fiber la nde seeds a vandu remove pandrathu it is done by hand hand only remove pannala but nowadays we use machine to remove the seeds next cotton fibers are converted into yarn these cotton fibers are converted into yarn what is yarn yarn means nool then yarn is then woven into fabric yarn is when woven into fabric fabric means cloth this is a cotton plant um cot we cotton plants uh, cotton is used to produce cotton clothes also okay let's move to the next topic the next topic is production in uh, core fibers uh, core fiber core fiber is obtained from the outer covering of coconut fruit coconut fruit la ulla outer covering la outer covering la nda enna kedaikudhu core fibers the outer covering is called husk the outer covering is called husk husk is removed and it soaked into water up to 10 10 months this husk is removed and soaked into water for at 10 months up to 10 months soften husk is beaten to get core fibers uh, soften husk is beaten to get core fibers the core fibers are spun into yarn these yarns are used to make mats garden articles ropes and floor uh, floor covering these are the production of the core fiber core is obtained from the outer covering of coconut fruit the outer covering is called husk husk is removed and soaked into water up to 10 months uh, soft and husk is beaten to get core fibers these core fibers are spun into yarn these yarns are used to make mat garden articles ropes and floor covering and the floor is also india and sri lanka are the world major producers of core fibers uh which uh, india and sri lanka are the world major producers of core fibers today class what we have seen uh, the production of plant fibers one is jute cotton and core i hope you all must have understood uh, today's topic thank you students